In a social media post on Friday, Gaskin voiced concerns about the tabulation process at GCOM becoming the only dissenting voice from the incumbent party. Nearly everyone else, from the diplomatic community to civil society to United States politicians, have said the process lacked transparency. Gaskin admitted that it is unlikely that all the credible observers who criticized the election process could have somehow gotten it wrong. He also questioned why GCOM and Region 4 returning officer Claremont Mingo appeared so reluctant to conduct the process in a transparent manner. In his statement, Gaskin alluded to a few rotten eggs seeking to divide the nation and he urged GCOM to publish the statement of polls or lose credibility. Meanwhile, AFC executive Raphael Trotman was asked about Gaskin's comments when he appeared at a press conference earlier today. Trotman said that Gaskin's comments do not reflect the majority of AFC members but rather are his personal opinions. Uh, Mr. Gaskin um, has his own personal views. I can say that the overwhelming majority of the AFC membership and leadership um, does not share that view. And I believe that following last night's conclusive declaration, we feel now that GCOM has regained some lost ground because it has been frustrated from making any headway for uh, close to 10 days. And we're satisfied that the process has moved forward. So we respect Mr. Gaskin's personal views, but they certainly are not the Alliance of Changes. Gerald Bryan, The Evening News.